So she said, if you have the dog pretty consistently outing off something of lesser value, a ball or a toy or things like that, and you're going on to something of greater value, a sleeve or something like that, and they're having trouble, does it mean you went too fast? Sometimes yes, and sometimes no. So sometimes, yeah, means you jump some steps. The other option is, is the person, like when you switch to a sleeve or something like that, and or you switch to bigger equipment or equipment that goes onto the body, a significant amount of that is controlled by the person in the sleeve. Like how much stimulation did I create, right? So if I have a sleeve and I'm super calm and I don't do anything and I just give the dog a bite and then I just don't barely move, I just sit right down and sit still, then there wasn't a big fight. But if I catch them like normal and wee -hoo, swing them around, yeah, now doubt, no way, right? So I control, as the decoy, you control stimulation to some degree too. So sometimes it's the object. Also, when you go into equipment that the dogs had on the body, like sleeves and suits and things like that, sometimes they have uh, uh, arousal-based uh, experience with that. Somebody's used a stick a lot, fired them way up a lot, all that kind of stuff, right? And so some of that stuff can be tricky to work, to work through.